ready for this? What's going on guys? Sorry for the short break. Uh, welcome back to the Blowfish Battle Network. We got another great battle with Matt. He's my little brother. We battled him before, if you guys remember. Uh, today we got another great battle. It is a versus recorder video that happened while we were battling without my equipment to record it. So I'm going to try my best to keep up with the replay. Uh, as you know, the replays go faster because there's no time to think. It just replays what happened. Um, anyway, uh, if you, I am bringing, of course, my Jamie Fox, the Nine Tails, Penny, the Jolteon, Hardly Newer, the Scyther, Marcy Grossman, the Metagross. I think that's new to this channel. I don't think I've used him yet. Catching the Hacks, the Haxorus, and Greninja, the Greninja, one of my favorite Pokemon. And I'm sorry you can't really see because of my little picture in picture thing going on, but my opponent is bringing a Machamp, a Rapidash, a Vivillion, Excadrill, Mantine, and a Venusaur. Uh, in this match, he is going to go ahead and lead with the Venusaur, which I am going to go ahead and lead him with my Ninetales, because it is what it is. Uh, I believe he's carrying a Megastone on that Venusaur. Um, <clears throat> so we're going to get the Thick Fat, so the fire's only going to be uh, neutral. It's not going to be super effective, it's going to cut it in half. However, he's not going to take that chance. Uh, he is going to switch out, so I'm going to go ahead and get a Nasty Plot off. There's the switch, and he's coming into Rapidash. See, he was reading the fire move right off the bat, uh, and ra his Rapidash is carrying the Flash Fire, I believe. So, we just we can't stay in because all I got a Solar Beam, and Rapidash is going to resist that immensely. Uh, that's going to take a lot more damage than I would have liked from the Rapidash, but Ninetales is a special wall, not a physical one. So, we are going to get off a Confuse Ray and just hope that this Rapidash can't break through the Confusion, and it's just going to end up. Taking itself out, uh, I sw at this point switch into Greninja the Greninja. Greninja the Greninja. Rapidash is confused, fire type hits itself, I got a Greninja. Greninja's pretty fast, and it's a water type, so he's going to withdraw, he's going to withdraw. I think he's going to go back in the Venusaur, I don't remember. No, he goes in the Mantine, that's right, he trolls me hard. He sees the water move coming, sends in the Mantine. The Mantine's got water absorbed, so... We get zero damage. So I switch the Greninja back out. I'm fairly certain to go into Penny right here. There's Penny, electric move. Oh, excuse me. I think I just had a gnat fly in my nose. Uh, we get the, He gets the Toxic off. We don't. So that's unfortunate because Penny's really a staple in my team. I really, really like this Jolteon. He's fast. He's super powerful. He's choice spec. I mean, it's just it's really, really difficult to live a hit unless, of course, it's resisted or at least not do a obscene amount of damage. We're going to go into Catching the Hacks with the Man Team. Why did... Go into Catching the Hacks with the Man Team. Alright, goes into the Venusaur. Whatever. Comes into the Venusaur. Ah, uh, I believe he's going to Mega at this point. I switch out. Uh, that's right. I was switching out for a bait. I go into Scyther. Uh, hardly knew the Scyther. That's that's pretty obvious. We're, we're bug flying. We've got a pretty good advantage over this Venusaur. Pretty good advantage over this Venusaur. Uh, he is going to switch, no, he's going to Leech Seed, Leech Seed, that's what it was. Um, I, and I'm going to X Scissor, I'm not even going to bother with the Sword Dance. I, I don't, I, even though we've got a good advantage, I don't think, I don't think I was confident, yeah, there it is, the sword, because this would be a, wa a wasted Sword Dance. So I went ahead and did the X Scissor, uh, does almost nothing to that Rapidash. And asleep, and I'm seated, so I gotta get out of there. I gotta get out of there. I do think I'm going back into the Greninja at this point. Uh, that's really the only move I got, because Rapidash is fire. Um, I've got a few ground moves, but this is the really obvious one until that happens. That, uh, that was not what I was expecting from that Rapidash, but the note has been taken, and I will, from here on out, expect the wild charge from a Rapidash. So we're going to send in, we're going to go and send Jolteon, it's fast, I know we're going to kill it, I'm sorry, <sighs> Penny, but he withdraws, uh, it sends out Venusaur, we are, is it Venusaur or Venusaur? I don't know, comment and correct me, whichever one it is, we're going to Shadow Ball, it's not going to do a lot, it's going to do about a quarter, we are poisoned, so that's unfortunate, um, and Penny's choice, so we know we're not doing much, and I'm really, I was worried about the Earthquake on the Venusaur. Uh, he Giga Drains me, that's not going to do much at all. We're going to, I think, four times resist that. 
Um, so he's not going to recover much either. At this point, at this point, did I, I, I think I swords danced at some point with, with the Scyther, but I can't remember. Yes, there it is. Hardly knew her swords danced. Into the Excadrill. Now, there's really not a lot of substantial things we can do with this Excadrill. And the Eviolite Scyther is not going to stand up to that rock slide. It's, uh, I want to say 4X. You just... You can't touch a 4X. So here's the Excadrill. Uh, we are carrying... I'm not... That's... Bleh! That's catching the Hacks the Hacktress. That's the Excadrill. We're packing the Earthquake. We do outspeed. We got the Sword Stance up. So he's just going to go ahead and let this extra... Excadrill... Daggone it. <laughs> let this extra... He switched him out. He switched him out of Pavilion. I used the Dragon Claw. Seeing this... Uh, reading the switch. Um... At this point, he wasn't too happy with me because I read the switch. He hung on with the sash. Oh, a little unfortunate, but he puts me to sleep, so I got some sleep fodder. Uh, at least something to just stall. I, I've, I, you can just count him dead. Um, he's, he's pretty frail, but I think I think that's my own doing. I don't think I trained him upright, but he's super powerful and pretty fast for our Haxers. Uh, so we're going to go into Marcy Grossman because we're packing the priority. Uh, used a Quiver Dance, but... Just not going to do it because I got the bullet punch. I, I appreciate what he's going for, but I've got the bullet punch. It's just, I'm not going to let it happen, bro. Here comes the bullet punch. Takes down the pavilion after a quiver dance. Thank goodness that pavilion could have turned out to be a big problem had he hung on to that quiver dance. Extra drills back out. We're going to bullet punch again. It is going to be enough to take him out. Uh, I was a little worried about it because it's steel and ground, and I, I, don't, I don't know why. I think I might have been overthinking it or thinking it wrong. But I was worried the bullet punch, we're going to take it, it's weak, but it is stabbed, it is stabbed, we got EVs and IVs and attacks, so we're going to get Leech seated here. <sighs> That's so annoying. I think like he's, he's seated almost every one of my Pokemon. Oh, and he avoided the dag, gone, he avoided the, the Zen Headbutt. I think Zen Headbutt is 4x on a Venusaur. Uh, I don't know, it must have been because he immediately switched out, he didn't want any part of that. Goes back into the man team. Man time, man team, whatever. Uh, we're gonna. Woo! It's a crit! It is a crit, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna take off a lot of damage with that. Gets the lefties up and the leech seed. This is gonna be a lot more than I would have liked. Um, I don't think a bullet punch would take him, but I do go ahead and do the bullet punch. It is not gonna be enough. It is not very effective. He, but he flinches. He flinched. Thanks to the King's Rock Metagross. I love King's Rock. Oh my goodness. I could not have caught a flinch at a better time. So that's fantastic. Um, unfortunately, he's going to cover enough health to get right back to where he was. And he protects, so he's just going to he's gonna recover more health. This is... It's very obnoxious. I don't know... I, I mean, I didn't see that coming at all. Uh, so I think what we're going to end up doing is a Zen Headbutt again. I think he's going to leave it... I'm sorry. I keep getting all under the camera. I gotta sit up straight, gotta work on my posture. I mean, he just, he just keeps... He's, look at this, look at this. He tried to protect again, it failed. You cannot pull off a double protect on me. I will not let it happen. We're gonna Zen Headbutt. It's finally gonna be enough to take out this man team before he recovers all of his health with Protect, Leech Seed, and Lefties. Holy crap. So he sends out the Machamp. Sends out the Machamp. Uh, I don't know what world we were playing in, but Marcy Grossman just outsped him a Champ with Aerial Ace. It is gonna do just under half... So if I, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna live this. That's unfortunate. Um, but we did get a good chunk of damage off on that Machamp, and that is fantastic. He's life orbed because he gets off that dynamic punch, and I live, and I am confused, and it is awful, awful, awful. He's gonna withdraw the Machamp, save him for later. Goes back out into the Venusaur. Um, I think I go ahead and just T-bolt him. No, I Shadow Ball again. I Shadow Ball again because I, at this point, I couldn't remember if he had anything ground with him. We do have the Venusaur under half health. That is a fantastic advancement in this. The Mega Venusaur is just a tank. I've run one before uh, when I was just really getting into hardcore competitive battling, and I, I just... He's a, he's a tank. That's all there is to it. He's got thick fat, so fire and ice are halved. Um, he's going to Giga Drain this. It's not very effective. I'm going to hold out with that fire once again. He's not going to have a lot. Just barely gets above half again. We're going to Flamethrower. Even though he's got thick fat, and we are not going to take him out, just 
Barely. And it's it's really too bad because I just recently got rid of Quick Attack on this Ninetales. Hmm. But it doesn't matter, he took me out anyway. Uh, Jolteon's in there. At this point, I'm going to T-Bolt him and I'm running out of time, so hold your horses. Dang. Alright, I did T-Bolt him. Uh, we missed it because I had to restart the video. Uh, we T-bolted the Mega Venusaur, it did take him out, thank goodness. Um, Penny is going to T-bolt the Machamp because he's, he's choice spec He's going to take out the Machamp. We have two big threats from this team taken out in two turns, in a two-turn swing, thanks to my main man, Pe man? Pe yeah, but, no, yeah, my main man, Penny. i got to change that name. i got to get a better name for my Jolteon. We're going to T-bolt the Rapidash. He has got so many weak Pokemon right now from all the switch-outs, it's just worn down. That's all competitive battling is, is strategy and wearing them down. That's the win with this battle. Fantastic battle. Huge shout out to Matt. Thanks again for the battle, as always. We gotta get more going on. Again, guys, sorry it took so long to get this battle up. A lot of last minute plans for my birthday. I'm heading out the door now. I am so glad I could get this to you. Remember, after the video, scroll your way down, leave a comment. About the, correct me on the Venusaur. I don't care. Correct me on all, any of my strategy. I know I've got flaws. But on the way down, remember to smash that like button. Hit the follow. Hit the share. Do whatever you got to do. But please show me some love. I would really appreciate it, guys. Uh, I'm going to try to get some Smash videos up pretty soon. I don't know how I'm going to do that because you got to actively, you know, you got to smash. It doesn't really work to sit it still like with a Pokemon battle where you can reach around and hit the buttons. Um... I am really, really, really close to getting that capture card. Like I said in my last video, I've got the DS. It's sitting over there. I would get it. I got the DS. Uh, I just got to get a few more extra bucks. I got to mail it off, and then we and then we wait, and then we wait. We're gonna have a capture card. We're not gonna have the little black edges around the screen over there. Yeah, over the black edges around the screen over there and on the bottom. Really sorry about that, guys. I know sometimes we get some a little bit of glitchy and it, it focuses and stuff. Anyway, I'm gonna wrap it up. I'm heading out the door. I'm going to Sam Ash and Guitar Center to go make a fool of myself and maybe buy something. Till next time, homies.